Hello everybody, welcome back to my tutorial series on WooCommerce discounts. In this video, we're going to learn how to offer discounts for specific custom taxonomies such as brands, tags, etc. Alright, so let's get started. Well, we're going to use the popular WooCommerce discount plugin called Discount Rules Pro for WooCommerce to create such discounts. Before we get into the video, please make sure you have downloaded, installed and activated the Discount Rules Pro plugin on your site. If you haven't done this yet, then please do not worry because we have a video that can help you to install the Discount Rules plugin which we have posted already. You can find the link to download the plugin as well as the tutorial video in the description below. Feel free to check the description below for further details. With that being said, let's get started. Custom taxonomies are nothing but brands, tags, etc. Isn't it? So in order to provide discounts for these custom taxonomies such as brands and tags, we'll have to first create them in WooCommerce and then start giving discounts to those specific brands and tags in WooDiscountRules plugin. Alright? In this video, for instance, I'm going to give discounts for a specific brand. Alright? So let me show you what I've done to create the brand and how I have associated products to that specific brand. Alright? Let me take you to the plugins tab and here you can see that I have used this particular plugin perfect brands WooCommerce for creating brands for my WooCommerce store. Alright. Using this I have created a brand. Let me show you what it is. The brand is called Polo and I have four products that fall under this Polo brand. Alright. Now we will have to go to the products page and assign products to this Polo brand. Alright. Let me show you that as well. Let's consider this polo t-shirt. I'm taking you to the product page, the back-end product page. And if you go further below, you can see that this specific product is associated to the polo brand. All right. So make sure you do that for every product that you would like to offer discounts for a specific brand. Okay. Associate the product to the specific brand that you have created. And then you can go ahead and start creating discounts using the discount rule plugin. All right. Let's go ahead and create the discount rule for this specific brand named Polo. To do this, we're going to go to the WordPress dashboard. Under WooCommerce, you'll find Wood Discount Rules. And if you click on Add New Rule, you'll be able to create a fresh rule. Here, we are going to enter a title and start configuring the rule. Okay, as said, we're going to offer a flat $20 discount. A flat $20 discount on a specific brand named Polo okay polo brand nice after you enter a suitable title let's go ahead click on the drop down below and select the discount type i'm gonna select the simple product adjustment discount type you can also select others according to your choice next we'll have to decide the products that are eligible for this particular discount rule as said this is going to be for a specific brand isn't it so let's just make sure to select brands here click on the drop down and under custom taxonomy you'll be able to find something called brands Right, nice. Now remember, it's important for us to restrict or limit this particular discount rule to apply only for a specific brand named Polo. That's why you've selected brands here and enlist meaning to include. So make sure you select enlist and here you'll have to select the specific brand that qualifies for the discount. All right, so I'm going to select Polo here. Remember, you will be able to find brands here only if you have created the brands and have assigned products to that specific brands. All right, so make sure you Create the brands first, like I've showed you already. Associate products to that specific brand. And then you'll be able to load it here. Alright, nice. Make sure you do not skip that important step for creating discounts for custom taxonomies. Nice. After we do this, we'll have to just decide the discount type and the value. I'm going to select the discount type to fix it discount. Okay. And set the value to 20, meaning a $20 fixed discount is going to be applied on products that fall under this brand polo. Nice. That's all. Creating the rule is pretty easy, isn't it? Now you'll have to just save and close this particular rule. And I'm going to take you to the storefront and show you how this rule works. Make sure the status of the rule is enabled, meaning active. Let's go ahead and test the rule by going to the storefront. Here we are on the storefront, isn't it? Now let me take you to the brand polo 
whose products are eligible for this particular flat discount all right so let's consider this product cap all right so here you will be able to find the brand that is associated with this so i'm going to click on this here we are on the brands page this is the polo brand page and here you can notice there are four different products that qualify for the discount because they belong to the brand polo all right let's go ahead and add some products to the card and see if they qualify for the discount i'm going to add this long sleeve tee to the card all right now you can notice that this specific product is eligible for the discount where you can get this product for five dollars because a flat twenty dollar is applied to this particular product and that's why we're going to get this product for five dollars all right and you can also notice that this specific product belongs to the polo brand nice now add this product to the cart i'll take you to the cart page now you can notice that we have received this product for a 20 dollar fixed discount nice great isn't it so this is how discount on custom taxonomies work thank you so much